morning. I just got back from a yoga class and I'm starving, ravenous, not dramatic. I want to make an avocado bowl, saute chickpeas, mushrooms, and I think I have some Ezekiel bread in the freezer. It'll be really delicious with that. How does that sound, Grandma? Sounds good to me, honey. Sounds good to her. Ingredients! One avocado, lemon, parsley, cilantro, a little bit of both, spinach, mushrooms, Jimmy Garbanzo beans, Ezekiel bread, three cloves of garlic, salt, pepper, paprika, curry powder, chili powder, turmeric. I just rinsed off all the mushrooms, whole pack, because one, I'm hungry, two, they've gotta be used. I for sure lied with what we'll be starting with, garlic. Take off the jacket. In the mood for savory this morning. A little salty. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love garlic. A little bit. I will throw the garlic right in the pan. No oil, just a little bit of water. And let that cook for a few. So it's like fragrant in the kitchen, yes? A little water, not a good amount there, three cloves. I live for mushrooms, delish. We're left with a whole container here, whole cutting board. So I'm gonna throw this in with the garlic. It's just starting to simmer up. You can hear it sizzling behind me. We'll give this a nice professional little swirly roux. Whole cutting board, should've used a bigger pan. Oh, shoot. For sure should've used a bigger pan, considering I want a whole can of chickpeas in here. Okay, these are cooking down a little bit, which is nice. And then I just rinsed the chickpeas off quite a few times. I'm just going right in with those. Pan filling up quickly. We'll give this a little zhuzh. Perfect. Already smells good thanks to the garlic. Make it even fuller. But this so cooks down. Two heaping handfuls of the spinach. Mix it up and it'll cook it down. As this is coming together, there's quite a bit of water at the bottom. And that's just, I believe, from the mushroom and spinach cooking out. Oh, nice. Wow. Preference for me is smoked paprika, but that's not here. Sprinkle. We like the heat. Little chili powder. Same. Sprinkle. Turmeric. Most important of all of these, hands down, is the curry powder. I'm not even playing. If you only have one, make it this one. Make this priority. A black pepper. I glad. Loud professional sea salt. I prefer the pink. But again, beggars can't be choosers. Ooh, 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 ooh. And zhuzh. And pending how it starts to smell, I may add more curry powder, to be totally honest. Ooh, I smell curry. Oh, see? That's what I was just saying. It's like- I smell curry. Yes. Yeah. Yes, girl. Chickpeas are flying. Turn that down. Can't see. My glasses are fogging. <laughs> <laughs> you got goggles? Throwing the top back on that, turned it on super low. Just let that cook. Back on the other side. Now let's go with the base of the avocado. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, they're perfect! Yay! So supportive. The base of the bowl. This is about to be a pretty big meal, so I'm not playing with the bowl size. Whole avocado. And I find the more fats that I integrate in my diet, better off it is for the old skin. Half of the lemon, and I'll throw the other half in my water. Resourceful. Sprinkle of salt. Grind of pepper. Didn't include this in the ingredients, but a little tahini in the avocado. Parsley just went in my water. Do my herbs right into the avocado. That was parsley. Same with cilantro. Yes, I keep the stems because I cannot be bothered to pick off all of the leaves. Are you kidding? Please. I'm hungry, let me eat. Eat already, eat already. So then we'll just mix all that together. Super fast, super easy. Last thing that I have to do is defrost one slice of toast. I keep it in the freezer because otherwise it goes bad in five minutes. So one piece of toast, I'm gonna throw that in the microwave for 15 seconds and then toast it in the toaster. 43. So I've kindly shoved all the avocado to one side. This looks delish. And here's from the stove top. You're a busy little bee. And it's quite nice, the parsley and the cilantro over what I cooked on the stove. Yeah, that's perfect. 
and deep breakfast. Incredibly easy. Super fast, right? That took me like 15 minutes? Probably. Maybe yeah. 20. And now I get to have breakfast with grandma. Yes. Yes. Okay, so before I smash and not pass this meal, thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like and a thumbs up. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, turn back. If you like this video, please give it a like. I've said this so many times. <laughs> you are worthy of it. You deserve it. I'll see you all in my next video. So I'm gonna eat this and we're gonna have a great Wednesday. Not for nothing, but this is so good. The citrus with the smashed avocado and then the savory of the curry powder and the paprika on the chickpeas and mushrooms. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow! Woo! It's so good. Mm. Well, I know they keep saying that, but you do what you need to do. And I rub in my eye. <laughs> Well, just do a little makeup wipe underneath in the region because your left eye looks way darker than your right eye. Well, there's a lot of you put all this eyeshadow up here. Because if you look, it doesn't look way know. different. Not tough shoes. You gotta, you gotta restart there. Oh, it's okay. Anything? It's okay. No. Well, it also is what it is. So you're gonna have to redo it. You don't have to restart and wash your face. Just... No. I'm going to have to redo it. That's called a touch up, yeah? You are worthy of it. You deserve it. <laughs> the outro. You know, it's just, we're learning, but we're working on it.